Hey there YouTube, my name is Neos, and um, today I'm going to be reviewing um, one of my favorite programs, which also has a channel on YouTube that you should subscribe to. Um, anyway, but I am a huge, a huge wrestling fan, like a huge wrestling fan, man. Um, but yeah, I'm going to be talking about WWE, or one of my favorite pay-per-views of the year, which every wrestling fan, you know, that is a real wrestling fan, waits for every year, which is WrestleMania. Now, um, I sort of, you know, um, can't really show you that much of the DVDs, but, um, I'm gonna go from, like, uh, WrestleMania 25, that review, up to WrestleMania, the current one, which is 28, I think, um, yeah, but this is gonna be a pretty good review, um, yeah, I'm just gonna reviewing, be reviewing the matches, why I think is a good WrestleMania, or if it wasn't the best WrestleMania, but why it was an alright one, you know, um, so just sit back and relax. So here it is. WrestleMania, I'm going to start with 25. I'm going to show you the DVD case, which I have, you know, I'm like I said, I'm a big wrestling fan. Here it is. WrestleMania 25. No, this is a old case. I have had it since it came out, which was 2009? Yeah, 2009, sorry. Um, But yeah, why I thought this was a good pay-per-view, uh, well, mainly the matches. Like, it had Chris Jericho versus so many legends, such as, sorry, i got to read off this, um, Rowdy Roddy Piper, Jimmy Superfly Snooker, Ricky the Dragon Steamboat, you know, in their corner was Ric Flair, which, they are all legends of wrestling. Legends. Now, there is another match which, um, led up to the next, you know, year's pay-per-view of WrestleMania, but I'm not going to talk about that, I'm going to talk about that soon, which was Undertaker versus Shawn Michaels. This was said to be one of the best, or I think it was actual, um, the best match of the year. And this was the whole year, there were so many matches, like, there was like, Punk versus Jeff Hardy, That those were good matches, you know, um, there was like Cena versus Orton. Those were awesome matches. But, you know, they said it wasn't them. It was Undertaker versus Shawn Michaels. I gotta agree with them. That was a good match. Um, Now, another match which stood out to me the most was this was actually Jeff Hardy's last WrestleMania. And he had an Extreme Rules match with his brother, Matt Hardy. Jeff Hardy, Matt Hardy... Extreme Rules match. Gotta watch that. Got to watch that. I don't think it's in any of their DVDs. You have to buy this pay-per-view to watch it. Or watch it on YouTube. You know. Subscribe to them. Um. Yeah. Some of the main events like, um. Triple Threat match. With, um. John Cena, Edge, and Big Show. Those are good. They have Randy Orton versus Triple H. Those are good. But mainly. Jeff Hardy. You know. Matt Hardy stole the show with their amazing, and I mean amazing, Extreme Rules match. WrestleMania 26. This year, like, um, this, the year that this was, well, first came out, was considered the best WrestleMania, well, I consider it the best WrestleMania ever. Um, you know, many reasons, such as, you know, um, you know, Bret Hart versus Mr. McMahon getting his revenge, John Cena versus, sorry, um, versus Batista, Chris Jericho versus Edge, but as you can see by the cover, you know, Undertaker, Shawn Michaels, the best match, well, you know, one of the best matches in WrestleMania history. Now, here's what was at stake. Now, you know how The Undertaker, I'm not sure if you know this, I don't know if I already said it earlier, 
But Undertaker is undefeated at WrestleMania. That's right. He's undefeated at WrestleMania, which means pretty much what it, I just said. He's never been beaten at WrestleMania. Shawn Michaels, sorry. Oh, I hesitated there. But Shawn Michaels, on the other hand, he is named Mr. WrestleMania. You know, this name has to be lived up by something. Mr. WrestleMania, or the guy has never been beaten at WrestleMania. Shawn Michaels has been beaten at WrestleMania a few times. I'm not going to say, you know, a lot, because I can't necessarily say a lot. But the best people would have to have beaten him, though. Like, some of the best people. You know, um, but I thought this was a really sad match. It was an emotional match, but at the same time, it kept you on the edge of your seat. I watched, I, I'm, I'm not going to lie here, I I was, did not watch this live. Um, you know, I watched it on the internet, which is what YouTube is for. Well, not necessarily, because it wasn't really on YouTube, but you know what I'm saying. Um, nowadays, they have the channel for WWE, but I watched this online, and it was just emotional the whole way, because you didn't want either person to lose, yet the loser was, well, fired, yeah, um, I'm not going to tell you who wins or loses, watch the pay-per-view, I consider this to be a very emotional match, an emotional WWE pay-per-view, you know, Wrestlemania, um, yeah, uh, that's just my opinion. WrestleMania 27. Now, up until this year's WrestleMania, this was the best WrestleMania. Sorry if I got a whisper, I got a little complaint. Um, yeah, I gotta like whisper or stay a little bit quiet. Now, uh, you know, I got, I got, I, I live with other people, so I gotta be quiet. Um, I'm just gonna get a bit closer to the speaker. But WrestleMania 27. I thought was the best. Not because of the matches, because of the host. I am a huge, huge rock fan. If you don't know what I mean by rock fan, I don't mean, you know, the fan. I mean rock as in the rock. The people's champ. He is a wrestler. Um, most of you will know him as an actor, but no. He was a wrestler before he was an actor. Know that. He was a wrestler. Uh, a a, a good, a good wrestler, you know, um, but he didn't necessarily wrestle in this pay-per-view, but another reason I thought it was good was because, um, a lot of you are going to disagree with me here, but, uh, the John Cena match, um, it was John Cena versus The Miz, now, don't get me wrong, all used to be like, oh, he's he's a John Cena fan. I'm I'm not gonna lie, I am a John Cena fan, but you know the Miz, I was actual you know voting for him. Uh, John Cena, if you are watching with this, which I highly doubt you are, but if you are, don't take this offensively. But I was voting for Miz. Um, you know it's nothing personal. I just you know the the. The Miz says he's awesome, he, no offense, he kinda did beat you, um, he, he did, he did beat John Cena, if you guys didn't know, spoiler alert, you know, just saying, but this is a year old, I don't know if you've already seen this, but he did beat The Miz, don't get me wrong, it was with The Rock's help, but, you know, um, he did, The Miz did survive, like, a couple of SD holds. Uh, I got a picture here. Inside. Sorry, um, inside. See? Sorry, I'm gonna move it this way. See? He was standing those. I don't know if you guys ha have actually been in this hold, but I can tell you it actually hurts. I thought you got. I don't know if you guys are gonna say it doesn't, but it does. If it, if it's applied right, it hurts. Um, but yeah, all in all, this was a good pay per view. You know, not only that, it did have Triple H versus 
you know, Undertaker in a no holds bar match. Which means you can use any weapon, you can do anything basically. The only way you can win is by pinfall or submission. This is what a streak. Ironically, the winner who was Undertaker, you know, he didn't win by either, technically. He won by knockout. Which isn't actually in the description. It doesn't say the referee could stop the match, you know. It says win by pinfall or submission, not stop the match. But, you know, this was a good WrestleMania, and I thought it was one of the best. If I were to give my two reasons for what is the best WrestleMania and why, the best WrestleMania and the two reasons why, The Rock vs. Cena, Triple H vs. Undertaker, special guest referee Shawn Michaels inside a Hell in a Cell, streak on the line, try saying that five times people, I will do this in my video a lot, if I say, in my videos a lot, if I say that, but try saying that five times, let me say that again, Triple H versus Undertaker in a Hell in a Cell, special guest referee Shawn Michaels, yeah, not as easy as it seems, eh, I'm getting off topic again, um, but you know, um, I'm going to start with this one since, you know, I've been talking about it so much, um, I thought this was a good match because I love Hell in a Cell matches. No holds barred, basically, you slam your opponent into the cage, you gotta, only way to win is by, you know, pinfall or submission. Um, I found this pretty much better than last year because, the, um, sorry, um, Triple H versus The Undertaker faced last year in, no, in a no holds barred match. Um, you know, it was a good match. That was a good match. It was one of the best. This one topped last year. Now, even harder to say, you know, was, you know, Shawn Michaels was in it because they thought, oh, well, <laughs> this is what I thought, too. You know, <laughs> you know, Undertaker's done. Shawn Michaels is Triple H's friend. They've been friends for years, so many years. Longer than I've been alive, I think. Probably. Okay, maybe not that long, but, you know, around about that time, -ish, I think. Now I'm getting locked up again. Um, but, ironically, watch it, because, you know, it will give you a little twists, twists and turns and plot holes, I don't know what the words are, but it's a good match. Now, even better match, there we have it, Cena, Rock, two generations collide, the best, the best, sorry, match of all time. I'm not even just talking about WrestleMania matches, I'm talking about the best match of all time. I uh, know, you're the thinking, I'm getting a bit over-exaggerated, oh no, nah, this isn't the best match of all time, yes. It is. This is opinion based though. This is what I think. It is the best. I that's what I think. It is the best. Now, you know, um I got a picture in this, sorry. Let me just find it here. There we go. Now there is one thing I can see from this picture. Um I don't know if you guys can see it. Right there, I'm gonna zoom it in a little. The referee's reaction. Look at it. He's like, whoa, dude, you're gone. You're, you're, you've lost the match. I am a big rock supporter, not rock as in guitar. I said this last time. Um, sorry, I said this about five minutes ago, but the rock as in the wrestler, the actor, whatever you want to call him, he is awesome. You know, um, that's all I have time for now. Please subscribe and watch more videos. This has been a really long video. I'm sorry. Please subscribe and, uh. You know, thanks.